Eric Ten Hag set to meet with Cristiano Ronaldo today over his reintegration into reintegration. First team training. Yes. Come back, Cristiano, all is forgiven. Will it be a case of that? If you're in the Manchester United boardroom and it would appear that you couldn't shift Ronaldo in January, would you consider suggesting, listen guys, why don't we rip up his contract? No, I'd have the perfect solution. I'd get old Rip Van Winkle Sooness in to give him a little t- t- talking to about how wonderful he is. What are you going to do about Ronaldo? Um, I would I would absolutely, in, in terms of being serious, I would consider ripping up his contract if it was continuing along the same vein. Because they've paid, what, 15, 16 million quid for him, right? So he's two years into a contract. That, that, that's left on their balance sheet about four or five million quid. It's a non-decision. If he wants to go and the problems are still there and it's not a circle that you can square, what's the aggravation value? Some would say the share price might depreciate. I don't think so. Some might say that they'll lose shirt sales. I'm not sure. I think the bottom line is is that um, if it were the same problems as we're encountering now and as we're led to believe, it's an exercise in futility. What's the point? If your team's doing okay, United are in ascendancy, and the situation between Ronaldo, the club, and uh, the manager continues, yeah, it's an exercise in futility, as I've just said. For £5 million with a capital value on your balance sheet when you're turning over £500 million and the aggravation value to your manager probably supersedes £5 million, quid, what would be the point? Yeah. I mean, I mean, this is where they've got to. Ronaldo's training alone with a fitness coach. Oh, yeah. You know, while the, the, the team prepared for the Chelsea match. Well, that can't, I mean, if that's the case, it can't continue. It won't continue. It'll come to a head. And if it comes to a head and the decision is the economics of making a decision around a player, well, Arsenal wrote off a lot of money with Aubameyang. I know Ronaldo's in a completely different category of quality of footballer to Aubameyang, but it's not worth the aggravation. It's not a long-term play. Yeah, He's yeah. going to go at the end of the season, so what would be the point of holding him for another four months so we can listen to, to ever-decreasing mm. or ever-increasing newspaper headlines about the uproar at Manchester United? Yeah. That I would absolutely rip up what's left of his contract. Because it's worth anything. You're not going to sell him for anything, no, are you? No, 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 no. Jim White and Simon Jordan. Monday to Friday mornings from 10 on AM, on DAB, via the TalkSport app and on your smart speaker. TalkSport.